everybody welcome back to one leave tarot how you all doing i hope you are doing well and keeping safe thank you so very much to all of my beautiful kind soul subscribers out there for all of your love and support and for those that are new to my channel welcome i hope you'll join our beautiful community here as well thank you so much to those that have participated in a recent poll that i posted on our community post and as you know the candle wax reading for zodiac predictions for 2022 have received the most votes so i have done the first video on the first couple signs yesterday and this was already uploaded which was for aries and taurus so for today's video i will be doing gemini and cancer so i will be doing a couple zodiac signs a day until i reach the last couple signs okay so for tomorrow i will be doing leo and virgo okay so for today for gemini i will be using the green candle and for cancer i will be using the yellow candle okay the timestamps will be noted in the description box and the comment section below I'm going to go ahead and get started with Gemini's reading. Hello, Gemini. Welcome to your reading. I'm going to get you some water. Okay. So Gemini, this is my first time doing zodiac signs predictions and just relax and clear your mind. Whatever I'm able to see and channel, I will let you know. So just listen. I'm setting the intention for readings for Gemini for the year of 2022 prediction. Please show us what they need to know. This is for Gemini, Sun, moon and rising Gemini I'm seeing here that there's been a lot of overthinking for the year of 2021 for some of you you were in a lot of unhappiness situations involving relationship and family okay it's what i'm seeing here and for the year of 2022 you are going to be stepping out of this energy okay there is a lot of overthinking, okay? For others of you, if you were not in that situation, I'm seeing that in 2022, you might be encountering some type of family situations that will create overthinking, worries, 
unable to sleep or lack of sleep or sleepless nights, okay? But Gemini, I'm also seeing that you are going to be leaving, okay? You're going to be leaving this energy behind, okay? Either physically, you are going to be moving out of the situation, or you are going to change the way you see things, and you are going to, and because of this, Gemini, you are going to know how to resolve your situation. The way you feel, the way you think for 2022 will be very different, okay? You are going to learn to let go. I'm seeing that some of you here have been dealing with family situations and I'm seeing that um, there are children that are also involved, okay? And this is for some of you here. For others of you, I'm seeing dealings with a man, okay? And there's some of you that have been crying, but you are going to be stepping out of the situation, Gemini. You are going to be moving away. There's going to be a sense of release okay you're going to move forward you are going to although you are going to feel a sense of loss when you move forward gemini but you are going to be stepping into something better okay things are going to get resolved for you and through this experience of conflict or difficulties you are going to learn from the experience and you are going to be stepping into your power okay gemini you are going to make space okay it's what i'm hearing you are going to make space And you're going to make space for of having the energy and experience and enthusiasm, okay? It's what I'm hearing. That will help you accomplish something that you always wanted to do. So perhaps in 2021, for some of you out there, you were in some type of conflict in terms of relationships or family situation that created a lot of sleepless nights, but you are going to be changing the way you see things. You're going to be able to, and because of this, you're going to be able to deal with the situation or literally you are going to be leaving the situation and through the experience, you are going to be able to learn from that and you're going to be stepping into your power, okay? And you are going to be able to make room for things that you always wanted to do, okay? I'm also seeing that you are going to be much more wise, okay? Because of the experience that you have encountered and gained and learned from, you are going to be so much more intelligent. And you're going to be so much more courageous. I'm getting that you are going to have this intellectual power and authority to achieve, okay? 
you know, I'm, I'm hearing the phrase, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. That's the energy that I'm getting for you for 2022. You are going to be stepping into your power because of what you've learned. It made you stronger. So in 2022, you are going to be achieving a lot for yourself. Perhaps in 2021, you didn't have the time or the energy to do it because of situational things that happen, whether in a home, I feel more in the home or relationship, okay? But in 2022, you're going to have more time to focus on yourself, your own personal development and growth. You are definitely going to be stepping into your power, okay? At the same time, Gemini, I'm seeing here that you are going to be very affectionate, okay, and caring towards yourself. Perhaps you have not been able to take care of yourself well. It's time for you to practice some self-love and self-care. For 2022, I'm seeing that you are going to be paying more attention to not only personal development, whether it's career or your job or business, you are also going to be taking good care of yourself, okay? If you haven't been taking good care of yourself, for the year of 2022, this is the year to do that, okay, Gemini? You should be spending more time um, doing, I'm hearing pray, prayers, okay? Do a lot more prayers or self-affirmation, self-love affirmation is going to help you. move forward okay it's going to bring a lot more positive or positivity into your space do self-love affirmation like i'm loving i'm deserving i deserve love i'm lovable i'm enough I'm beautiful. I'm hearing Libra. Okay, I know this reading is for Gemini, but have some of you been dealing with a Libra person? Or there could be a Libra person in your life? Perhaps this is someone that's been either creating a lot of stress. For some of you and for others of you, I'm hearing that you might be meeting a Libra in 2022. Okay. I feel that whoever this person that you're going to be meeting for singles out there, you are going to inspire one another, okay? This person 
will inspire you and your life will change will be very different when you meet this person and same thing with this person you inspire one another okay it's what i'm hearing and this is for the singles out there I feel that things are going to balance out for you for the year of 2022. And I feel that it's a year for you to manifest, okay? For others of you, I'm hearing that you are looking for a soulmate. Um, if you are looking for a soulmate, what will help you for 2022 is doing lots of prayers and self-love affirmation. Okay, keep on hearing self-love affirmation. Say that you are deserving and you are enough. You are loved. You are lovable. Okay. Things are going to be not only balanced for you. Things are going to be happening for you slowly but surely is what I'm hearing. This year, I feel that you are going to be stepping into your power for 2022. Okay. You are going to be leaving the unhappiness of 2021 behind, okay? For sure, you are going to be stepping into your power and you are going to be the one that is going to be in control and in power of your life, okay? It's what I'm seeing here. Beautiful. I'm hearing, put your feet down, okay? Um, stay grounded as well, that's what I'm hearing. This year, you're gonna, you're gonna have a sense of this powerful energy rushing into your life, okay? Make sure you stay grounded, okay? That's what I'm hearing. Take advantage of the situation but at the same time stay grounded which i think you will not only you're going to exercise your power with integrity gemini i feel that you are going to have so much compassionate and kindness towards yourself and others but i feel that for 2022 the focus for you is yourself okay For others of you, you need to love yourself, okay? You need to feel that you are beautiful, you are enough, you are deserving, okay? I'm also seeing a rooster here, okay, for the Chinese zodiac. Gemini, are you also a rooster? Or maybe you'll be dealing with a rooster in the year of 2022. Or maybe 
you're going to be meeting someone with this rooster sign. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing. I'm seeing that for others of you, you're going to be spending more time with your family. I'm seeing like playful energy here. Maybe you're going to be having a lot of um, fun times with your family for those that are already married with kids, with children. All the sleepless nights, all the arguments are going to pass and things are going to get resolved for you. Gemini, in terms of your family situation. Okay, so I'm going to pull you some cards. I'm going to break this deck into two decks. I'm going to pull two cards from each back here to get additional messages for you. Okay, Cain, pay attention to your health. Lobster financial pinch. Okay. Pull two cards from this deck here. Okay. All right. So we have parrot. Someone will gossip about all your secrets. Dragon, beware of self-delusion. Okay, so Gemini, I feel that the gossiping, okay, and the self-delusion are going to be leaving you, okay? I mentioned earlier that there's there were a lot of sleepless nights and worries because of a family situation or um, there's some type of relationship situation either you are currently encountering or this started in 2021 and stepping into 2022 things are going to get resolved okay so all this you know self-delusion and gossiping conflicts arguments disagreements um, even financial pinch maybe some of you have some type of financial loss in 2021 i feel that all of this sadness or you know struggles and difficulties are going to pass even if you are if you were not in that energy or these energies in 2021 if even if you're going to be encountering this they are going to pass because overall what i'm seeing and hearing for you gemini is that you are going to be stepping into your power so even if these are going to be the things that you're going to be encountering for the first part of 2022 okay they are going to get resolved because you are going to have that much power and energy to move forward okay because you are going to learn you're going to learn from these you know the the um the experience of you know conflict or disagreements or unhappiness and some of you um this could be dealings with um you know children okay i'm hearing children uh involved you know but things are going to get resolved so don't be in the self delusion energy anymore okay or if you are going to be encountering any difficulties you know uh stay grounded okay i mentioned that stay grounded because you are going to have the power and energy 
okay? You're going to be stepping into that. I feel that maybe um, in the mid year, this is going to come in. You're going to have the energy and the power to do what you always wanted to do, okay? And you are going to have that wisdom, okay? That intellectual power and authority um, and, and courage to overcome any anxiety, okay? Or any um, fear, okay? And the only thing that I would suggest and um, advice or advise you for 2022 is to pay attention to your health. Maybe because of all of this conflicts or all these struggles, um, it has taken a toll on, on your health, okay? For some of you here. So for 2022, do lots of self-care, like I mentioned. So pay attention to yourself, your, you know, self-care, self-love, because when you do that, you you know, you are paying attention to your health, right? So the one thing that I would um, recommend or what I'm seeing from your readings here is your health, okay? And make sure you take care of yourself because all of this gossiping, all of this financial um, stressor is going to pass, okay? Um, if you, again, if it has been well, you did not encounter any difficulties in terms of conflicts with families or relationship for 2021, this could potentially happen to you in 2022. However, okay, however, I'm seeing that there's brightness, lots of brightness. Again, you are going to be stepping into your power, okay? Um, you're going to be the king is what I'm hearing. Um, you are going to hold, um, you know, the power to deal with situations that are um, no longer serving you. You're going to be standing up for yourself. You are going to have more compassion towards yourself. I feel that maybe some of you have not been able to stand up for yourself. It Again, it could be because out of fear or because, um, you know, you didn't have the energy to deal with, um, you know, all the conflicts because you were so drained in 2021. For 2022, I feel that you're going to have that energy that power to do that okay and things are going to be so bright for you okay so um step into your power and stay strong okay because things are definitely going to get better and focus on yourself more this year and pay attention to self-love and self-care as well as your health okay beautiful thank you so much gemini take very good care of yourself okay and stay safe I'm sending you lots of love and light. I'm wishing you prosperity and beautiful health in the year of 2022. I will see you in your next reading. Bye-bye. Hello, Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Welcome to your reading. Okay, I'm going to get you some purified water. Okay, so Cancer, this is a candle wax reading for Cancer, for predictions for the year of 2022. So Cancer, please relax, okay, and clear your mind. And imagine yourself in a beautiful place that is filled with lots of love and light. I'm setting the intention for a reading for Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising. What they can expect to see in the year of 2022. Please show us. Okay. Cancer, I don't know if you can see. I'm seeing a pathway, okay? I feel that you are receiving a green light 
for 2022 to do the things that you have always wanted to do. You are going to receive some type of approval or acceptance in either a job or passing an exam or are you going to get accepted into some some type of program okay or maybe your proposal is going to get approved your application is going to get approved everyone is different so cancer i feel that for 2022 you are going to be receiving the green light i'm also hearing right of passage i feel that for 2022 cancer for some of you here you are going to be transforming or stepping into a new milestone of your life okay this could be anything this could be graduation this could be getting married this could be having maybe you are going to be a mother or a father you are stepping into the next chapter of your life okay it's also what i'm hearing um for others of, others of you i'm hearing that you are going to be joining okay you are going to be either joining or collaborating okay you are going to be merging uh, is also what I'm hearing. You are going to be with a different social group or you're going to be joining a social group or some type of community, okay? Something new that you are going to be stepping into. That's what I'm seeing here. I'm also seeing that you are going to have a better a better handle, okay, of your financial situation. There's going to be more stability, okay? I'm also hearing prosperity. I'm seeing that I'm seeing someone being able to hold on to or budgeting, okay? you you are going to have some type of stability in terms of your, your, your financial situation that will allow you to better budget yourself or you are going to be able to budget yourself better okay for others of you i feel that you you are going to be the person being in control okay of your money or of your financial situation Perhaps some of you in 2021, you did not have good control of your money or things were somewhat off balance in terms of your financial situation. For 2022, Cancer, you are going to have better control of your money. Okay, I'm seeing someone holding a coin. It's like you have control now. Things are more stable now. You don't have to worry. At least you you are not going to have to worry about money. Okay? For 2022. There's going to be a change in your financial situ situation. 
there's going to be improvement, okay? You may not become rich, but at least you are going to have a good grip and good control that is going to give you a peace of mind. There's definitely going to be a change or an improvement in your financial situation in 2022, Cancer. It's what I'm seeing here, okay? I'm sensing like a breath of like relief, okay? You're going to go, okay, like a sigh of relief, okay? And I'm also seeing that there's going to be a lot of uh, reminiscing, okay? You are going to think back um, of the happy times in the past, okay? And I feel that some of you are going to be reaching out to your childhood friends or perhaps your childhood friends are going to be reaching out to you in the year of 2022 and you are going to be reconnecting with um, your friends um, either from childhood or friends that you have not been in touch with for the last at least five years or maybe three to five years is what I'm seeing here. I'm also seeing that you are going to have a lot of um, inner strength, okay? You are going to be very courageous in 2022. You're going to learn to let go of your fear, okay? And, or anxiety, that's also what I'm hearing. And you are going to Okay, I'm hearing that you are going to how should I say this you are going to have this inner strength to control your emotions you're going to be able to learn how to control your emotions and your fear and you're going to be able to turn this into strength and courageous, okay? At least you're going to have that strength and courageous to do that in 2022. There's this inner strength in you that you didn't know that you had. But in 2022, you're going to come to realize that you can do this, okay? I feel that everything is going to come out, is going to turn out well because you have the green light. Again, it's also what I'm hearing. You have the green light this year for 2022. Things are going to turn out in your favor. You're going to be a lot more caring and loving of yourself as well including others, okay? It's what I'm hearing. If you haven't been, or if for others of you, you have been doing a lot of negative self-talk, that's going to change this year for 2022. Perhaps you should try to change that, okay? Okay. I feel that you will for 2022. There's going to be this burst of inner strength that will guide you to be more self-compassionate and love and care for yourself, okay? It's what I'm seeing here. Cancer, because of this inner strength and this green light that you are going to be receiving in 2022, this will open up to a 
allow you, okay, is what I'm hearing, to allow you to achieve what you desire in 2022. Stay focused, Cancer, is what I'm hearing. Bring out that inner strength, okay? It's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing communication, okay? For 2022, communication is very important for you, okay? Sharing your feelings, speaking your mind. If things bother you, Cancer, for 2022, don't let it. Don't let them slide, okay? Be true to yourself. Speak your mind. Don't let things slide. I'm hearing that if you are not happy about something, make sure you communicate this, okay? Whether this is a job situation, a relationship, or a home situation. For 2022, you need to communicate your feelings and your and you need to share your feelings, okay? And meditation is very important for you for the year of 2022. You cancer, you are going to be the architect of your life. When you meditate, Meditate by ways of architecting your life, okay? I'm hearing that whatever that you want to see happening in your meditation, Build that, okay? Build it, literally feeling it, okay? When you meditate, the key to meditation is to focus on your breathing and make sure your breathing is, you know, at the same rhythm, okay? Not up or down, up or down, just the same rhythm. That's what I'm hearing. When you are in stillness, Cancer, When you meditate, your breathing is very important. Focus on your breathing. And during your medication, architect the world that you would like to be in. And this is going to come into reality. Okay, it's what I'm hearing for you for 2022. For those that are singles, okay, I'm hearing that you need to Trust yourself, okay? Whatever happened in your past relationship, let it go, okay? It's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing that the person or your ex, okay? Whoever that you were dealing with in the past that did not treat you well, I'm hearing that they are starting to understand your connection with them. I'm hearing that they're also working on themselves and they wish that they 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 wish that they had treated you better. That's what I'm hearing. Whatever that you want for 2022 and for the future beyond 2022, I feel that meditation or manifesting by ways of meditation is going to get you there. Okay, 
Wow, as I was just saying, the flame went off. And for those that are already taken, I feel that you are going to be enjoying your spouse or your partner a lot more. There's going to be a sense of oneness or you're going to feel a sense of belonging. Okay? I feel that whether you are in a relationship or not, you are going to feel a sense of belonging. Okay? It's what I'm hearing. You definitely have the green light, okay? The passage to the light, okay? To your wish, to whatever you desire, okay? You are going to be standing tall for 2022, Cancer. Wow, justice is on your side, is what I'm hearing. I don't know if you can see this person is standing tall. You have the green light or the passage, okay, to step into the real you. Don't let anything slide in 2022. If you need to speak up or if things start to bother you, you need to speak up, okay? Have you been dreaming a lot, Cancer? I feel that maybe some of you have been dreaming a lot. If your dreams have been bothering you, before you sleep, set the intention that you are going to have beautiful and sweet dreams, okay? Tell yourself that you are going to have sweet dreams before you go to bed. I'm um, seeing like the bumblebee here. And this is like a tree, okay? you There's gonna be some type of blossoming, okay? You are not going to, you are not only going to get your fair share for 2022. I feel that some of you have been shortchanged in 2021, but you are going to get your fair share for 2022. Things are going to get returned back to you, okay? And there's gonna be sweetness. Wow, that's why I'm seeing a bumblebee here. Things are going to be very sweet for you. And for those that have been having bad dreams, you can do this, okay? Like a lotus at night before you sleep. Tell yourself that you're going to have beautiful, sweet dreams and then you can go to bed, okay? I'm going to get you some cards to get more messages. I'm going to divide this into two decks. So this is for Cancer 2022 Spirit. I'm going to need two cards from this deck here. A throne. Position of authority. Wow, okay. One more card. Okay, so we have hand in need of help assistance and guidance okay so get two cards from here tankard celebration fun enjoyment okay one more card boot increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goals wow beautiful okay cancer 
So for 2022, things are definitely going to get better for you. You are going to be in a position of authority. Like I mentioned, justice is going to be on your side. You are having, you are going to be given the green light, the right of passive, okay? Or sorry, the right of passage, okay? You're definitely going to be stepping into your power. You are going to, you're going to be in a position where you're going to have more, like I mentioned about your financial situation, there's more security because you are going to have more control of your financial situation. So I feel that this position of authority has to do with your ability um, to have better control of your money, okay? And there's going to be a change or improvement in your financial situation. This is beautiful. And there's definitely going to be celebration, okay? Because if you're able to have more control of your um, financial situation, okay, you're going to have, you know, this is going to be um, a allow you, you know, to give you a peace of mind, um, which will allow you to, you know, proceed and, and pursue to do the things that you desire, right? So because when we are stressed about our financial situation, it, you know, it will hold us back from what we really want to pursue um, in terms of our goals, okay? Um, and I feel that um, this in need of help and assistance and guidance and um, I feel that maybe some of you need to ask for help if you need to ask for help, okay? Um, I'm getting the message that if you have put an application out there um, or if you have applied for something, I feel that it's time to reach out, okay? I feel that you need to reach out and ask them, okay? Um, or ask others um, for help to get you to um, get that application approved or get guidance as to how you can um, get something accepted or approved, okay? I, I keep hearing that you need to ask people to help you, okay? If there's an application or there's, um, perhaps some of you are going to be, um, if for those that are in school, I feel that you need to ask um, someone to help you out with your um, the way you study, okay? It's what I'm hearing. Perhaps you have a friend or maybe a professor or somebody that's going to be able to help you with the way you study, okay? And if it's an application or a job um, or you're waiting for some type of approval, it's time to reach out and inquire. Okay, see if you are able to um, see if others are able to help you understand as to how you can get your application or approval for some type of program or proposal. Okay, that's what I'm hearing. So be courageous this year. Okay, um, step out of step outside of um, the box. Okay, and uh, be proactive, okay? Reach out, okay? I feel like you need to reach out, okay? Be assertive for 2022, and it's it's going to lead you to celebration, okay? And yeah, oh my God. And look at this, boot. Increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goals. Exactly what I was just saying. So you definitely need to um, put a little bit of effort into whatever that you like. Okay, or your desires or your the goals that you want to pursue. Okay, you need to reach out. Okay, keep on hearing you reach out. Um, if there's, you need to for sure. I know maybe some of you said, um, or some of you are saying that you've done whatever you needed to do. I the message I'm getting for you, Cancer, is there is actually more. Okay. So reevaluate your situation because you do have the passage. You do have the green light to do what you need to do. You just have to um, be a little bit more assertive, okay? Don't be shy. It's what I'm hearing. And you are going to get there. Wow. Okay. 
that was all I had for you, Cancer. Thank you so very much for being here with me today. I'm wishing you prosperity, stability, and lots of love in the year of 2022. I will see you in my next reading. Take care.